Right, is it possible to treat autoimmune disease? I'm Eric Backer, the naturopath. Thanks for coming back. Many people uh, come, have come to me over the years with autoimmune disease when it was very advanced. You know, and we're talking like people, for example, with rheumatoid arthritis, with major joint deformity and things like that. It's too late. It's too late to do anything when it's very, very, very advanced. Well, it's not too late. You're going to get some improvement, but you're not going to get the dramatic improvement you would if you treated early on in the piece. That's why it's critical uh, for early detection and working out what's wrong at the beginning, okay? Now you all know the same thing. You've got an automobile that makes a small noise, but you keep ignoring it and you drive for another six months. And then the mechanic says, oh my God, look at this car. We've got to rebuild the whole front end on it. It's trashed. It's going to cost you five grand. But if you came last year, it would have cost you 50 cents. Exactly. Okay, an ounce of prevention. What do they say? A pound of cure. Be careful. All right. Things need fixing early in the piece. If you leave things too late, it is too late. All right. This is why in the early stages of autoimmune disease, I always like to do stool testing on patients to get their digestive system in tip-top shape to reduce the inflammatory responses in the gut to correct these things through natural medicines. And it works, it works for the majority of people. There are hundreds of cases of autoimmunity I work with. I'm not gonna use the C word, the cure word, but I am gonna use the word serious improvement with many cases. Hashimoto's thyroiditis, type one diabetes, right? Celiac disease, ulcerative colitis, all these conditions can be seriously improved when they're early in the piece, you get them. Even if the person's starting to advance, you can still pull them back a fair bit. But when you've got major pathology and tissue destruction, it's almost impossible to reverse that. Okay, you must remember that. And that's just being realistic, isn't it? Realistic. So the question is, is it possible to treat autoimmune disease? It is. But remember, if you're taking three or four drugs to control strong pain with rheumatoid arthritis, there's no point taking a bunch of turmeric pills thinking it's going to do the same, all right? That's why it pays for you not to get hooked on lots of pharmaceutical medications for autoimmunity to begin with. If you see a naturopathic doctor or an integrative medicine specialist at the onset or right in the early days of autoimmunity, it can save you a lot of bother and pain and misery. All too many patients I've seen over the years have gone through the medical mill, the GPs and the specialists, the rheumatologists or you know bowel specialists, and then ended up on my doorstep after all of the drugs failed and all the treatments didn't work and they were chronically sick, or the treatment made them sicker than the actual condition. So I'm not gonna tell you specific treatment protocols for specific autoimmune conditions. It's not my place to do so here, <clears throat> because otherwise I would spend a month of Sundays, okay? there are so many autoimmune conditions and so many variables. This is something that needs to be worked on with your integrative GP or naturopathic doctor. Uh, he or she can work out a very nice protocol and it will no doubt be based on some testing. It will likely be stool testing. It could be hormone testing, saliva testing, urine testing, stool testing. So specific tests like that can really help your practitioner guide you know, him or her into you know, a nice direction and allow that practitioner to assist you far more, in my opinion, than a medical person can. Medical people are great at acute repairs on the body, but when it comes to chronic conditions like autoimmunity, all they can throw at you are drugs, suppressive drugs, that don't really aim to heal or you know, uh, nurture the body in a positive way. They just control the symptoms, and oftentimes will reduce the quality of your life further by causing side effects. So the option's yours. You can go the medical route, or you can look at the natural route, or you can look at the integrative route, which is where you need to be. It's the best of science in medicine. So you'll need to contact your association or naturopathic association, but I strongly recommend you get onto it sooner rather than later with autoimmune conditions. But don't be fooled. You can be treated and get an, have a nice outcome with the right kind of treatment. We're not using the C word, remember, but we are saying that whatever your condition is, you should be able to improve it ranging from an average or mild up to significant improvement through natural means. Hang in there, it does get better. Stay with me, we're still talking about autoimmunity.